so werewolves and vampires won't come as a call. In fact, you won't get in many callers at all. Because down in the alley, the side of the success, it's magical creatures who visit the spread. On humans who read scary stories at night and sleep in their bedrooms without a nightlight. The thing to remember when you go to bed is putting a cross in your feet and your head. Because witches and vampires are religious. And touching a sign like a cross is a video. Goosebumps, warts, hives, the welts, the itches, which nobody likes in a vampire bath in the witches. But try not to toss or turn in your bed. If you pick up the crosses, you're going to wake dead. The thing to remember when you go to bed is to watch out for goblins who munch on your head. What stops them is water, so ask for a glass. Then pour it around so the goblins can't pass. Or else, make a run for the bathroom and turn on the hot and cold faucet and watch goblins squirm. As a last chance, since goblins all fear running streams, if you don't own a bathroom, bring water filled in. So that's my advice. Now just turn off the light and hope you at least you sleep well the next Halloween night. I'm